also going to be replacing the battery. I'll show you how to do that as well, because we have a little bit low voltage, 4.2 volts. And uh, it has a, uh, it's not carrying a load, so I'll show you how to do all this today. All right. First step is to remove the negative post of the battery. And since we're actually removing the battery today, we'll uh, actually replace the whole thing. So we'll take off the negative and the positive, removing the uh, negative first. So all I've done here is move the intake up out of the way so we can access the bolts that actually hold the battery in place. There's kind of a, a top here that keeps the battery from jumping around. Just two 10 millimeter bolts. We're going to remove those real quick. Now that we have the battery shredding on bolts in, we can just pull this out once we get the battery on. There's your old battery right there. We can install the new battery the same way that the old one was in. And we'll place the positive cable on first, then the negative. Make sure it's stacked safely in the tray as we have it here. So it's in the tray, now we'll bolt it back up and put the cables on. All right, now that we got the actual battery bolted in here, um, we're gonna take the positive cable, put it on, then put on the negative cable. All right, both the cables are now installed. Obviously putting the positive one on first, then the negative, then I, uh, Check the battery for voltage, make sure that it had enough voltage before I even started the car. I want to make sure it was a good battery. Should have done that before I placed it in the tray. Um, it had good voltage, so now we uh, gotta put that little cat back on there. Well, I feel